our TA. TAs know everything. Something bad happened. My flask tipped over. But something bad always happens whenever I do an experiment. It's either my flask tips over or something explodes. Did you make mistakes too? I still make mistakes. Wait, really? Yeah. What did you do? What did I do? Yeah. Um... No, I've had some pretty bad days. My worst day in lab. <laughs> <laughs> this is more like a worst, like, two weeks. My worst day in lab had to be the day where I had to smash fish. One day in undergrad, I was recrystallizing something on a hot plate. I was doing an RNA purification. First of all, I'm a little scared of fish. I had this mortar and pestle. I set up this big, huge, like two liter flask on a ring stand and everything, connected to a hose. And I had to put the little fish in and smash it to powder. The fish head just flew off onto the floor. And before I could fasten it, the hose whipped the flask across the room and it shattered all over. And I made some poison gas. By the end, I pretty much had nothing left and it was just a failure. <laughs> you're gonna cry at that point. I mean, they're, they're, your day cannot get any worse than that. The very first time, it's always nerve wracking. You know, this is your experiment and if things don't go right. There are going to be times where you may not feel like you're, you're going to be capable, but the truth is that you actually are. You just have to like step back, take a, take a deep breath. Remember like, you know, who you are, like where you came from. You have failures, of course, and you're, you're very yeah, disappointed and then you redo it, but this is, this is local and then you have to move on. Something bad always happens and I always have to start over, but Ting Fei told me that when she was an undergrad, she was even worse than I was. And look at her now, she's teaching us how to do all these things. It's so encouraging because if she can learn, then I can learn too, and someday I'll be just as good as she is. Oh wow, I, I really should have been wearing safety glasses here.